I've been a part of the Amazon Vine review programme for the last 13 years, which means Amazon sends me free stuff in return for me writing a review. Here's a look at some of the stuff they sent me in the last month. First up, we have a pair of men's loafers. It says on the product page for these that they are leather. I'm not sure I believe that. Lots of people on the product page seem to really like them, but to me, they're a little bit tacky, that kind of faux crocodile skin, very stiff, and I don't think anyone in our house is gonna wear them, so they will be heading off to the charity shop. Next up, this strange box of things are actually silicone feet, which go onto chair legs if we're using them on hard floors in the kitchen, or I guess anywhere. And they stop them from marking the floor, but also stop that horrible kind of grating noise as people pull their chairs in and out, particularly on tiled floors. We've put them on our chairs and so far they're doing the job brilliantly. So my dog always seems to get something every month from Amazon and this month it was a set of six indestructible balls and these are genuinely brilliant. For one, they're really easy to spot on the grass, unlike tennis balls. Two, they float if you throw them in water and normally our dog will tear apart a tennis ball in the space of about 24 or 48 hours. These we've had in the house for a couple of weeks and they are still intact, so thoroughly recommend these. Now this one's a bit random, just to give it context, we went on holiday this summer to Loch Ness, which by the way is beautiful. We did a boat all the way from one end to the other, very atmospheric. And of course we were looking for the Loch Ness monster. So this is a Loch Ness monster bookmark, which goes brilliantly in the current book, which my daughter is reading, which coincidentally is David Walliam's World's Worst Monsters. Now, my daughter also has a really good friend in Canada. It's quite expensive to send little presents to her. So this is a brilliant idea. This is a kid's friendship bracelet, very lightweight, goes into the envelope with a kind of greetings card and is quite nicely presented. So that will be heading off to Canada. And I think the idea is brilliant. And another thing for the dog, although it's kind of for me as well, it's a multi-way, multi-coloured dog lead, which you can wear crossbody. This is a set of bunting, paper bunting, card bunting, which you do have to string yourself. So it arrives kind of unstrung just with the cord and the separate letters, but it's bunting for happy new year. Now I really like these, they're a bit quirky, but these are uh, deep sea creatures and they're rubber, they're really tactile. And the idea is that kids are supposed to play with them in the bath. They don't have holes in them. So they're not kind of like squirty bath toys, which actually is good because they won't go moldy but they're kind of, you know, as I say, very tactile and quite cute. Now, this is a coffee capsule storage unit. The idea being that you put the coffee machine on top of the drawer and then you pull the drawer out and you can keep all of your coffee capsules very neatly underneath the machine. Uh, this is an eraser for kids in the shape of a lipstick and it's slightly scented as well. So this is sea salt spray for your hair, which I do use to achieve this. And it's from the men's range, which I didn't realize when I ordered it, but isn't that all a whole load of nonsense anyway? It's just sea salt spray. This is a box of accessories for the Ninja Jewel Zone air fryer, which I've done a couple of reviews of. This particular set fits in both the AF300 and the AF400. And with it, you get the racks, the little kebab skewers, tongs, a silicone brush, and some disposable liners, which frustratingly arrived a little bit squashed, which is annoying. This is a lovely little colorful book, which is supposed to be an introduction to myths and legends for children. And of course, goes rather well with the Loch Ness Monster bookmark. So these are turmeric capsules. I don't know an awful lot about turmeric, except that it's very good anti-inflammatory, 60 of them in the pack, and you're supposed to take two a day. This little thing is a USB-C to Apple adapter and we always need multiple adapters and cables in this house. So in fact, there's two of them in this pack and they will be used. This is a blusher, which I haven't tried out yet, but it kind of comes in a stick like a lipstick and is apparently very easy to blend. I've mentioned it before if you've watched any of my other Vine videos, but there's one thing that my kids cannot get enough of, which is slime. So we have another box of slime, cute little pots, lots of different colors. Might put that aside for Christmas because we're quite close to Christmas now and save me having to buy some. 
And these are a pair of really tight compression shorts for exercise. I've tried them on in the house. I could barely move around in them because they were so tight and I haven't actually had the courage to wear them to the gym yet. But if you're into really tight compression shorts, I think these might fit the bill. So that rounds everything up for this month. If you want to find out what I get next month, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notifications and I'll catch you then.